flag up. They're under starter's orders. And they're away. And as they go down towards the Melling Road, it's Furor, who's taken it up from on the inside, Peckard, then moving up towards the outside, Miss Hunter with Lymetra, then Flo Subarb and Kilburn towards the outside. And it's Peckard, the grey, disputing it with Furor. Then comes Lymetra, Miss Hunter towards the outside, and Flo Subarb. And as they cross the Melling Road, we join our country cameras and Julian Wilson. And the field very tightly bunched at this stage, still a long run to the first. Castle Falls disputing it towards the outside is the Fossa. Towards the inner is Ferryboat and Lemaitre and Flo Subarb. And over the first, it's Miss Hunter disputing it with Flo Subarb and Lemaitre. Towards the outside, the Fossa, Castle Falls, and then Fearless Fred. And no fallers at the first as they come into the second. It's the Fossa disputing it with Castle Falls. Lemaitre on the inside, then Furore. Then comes Flo Subarb. Towards the outside is the Fossa, Kilburn. And no fallers again at the second as they come into this third fence, the first open ditch, with Castle Falls disputing it with Ferrari on the inside, Lemaitre just between these two. Then comes the Fossa and Flo Subarb. This is the order as we join Michael O'Hare. And Tudor four to fall are there coming to this next fence now, and Castle Falls still up there in front with Miss Hunter and Lemaitre and the Fossa. And Fearless Fred is gone. Fearless Fred is a faller there. The Fossa made a bad mistake, but they recovered quickly. There's still Castle Falls on the outside, Miss Hunter, Lemaitre. These are the leaders, and they're followed by Kilburn, Juan on the outside, Steel Bridge on the inside, Ferrari right up with the leaders too. They're coming now to Beaches for the first time, and as they do so, it is Castle Falls who's just the leader on the outside with Miss Hunter, Lemaitre, Ferrari, Kelsborough Wood, Close the Barb is over there, and very nearly a, a faller there, but not quite. It was uh, the Fossa who looked like making trouble there, but didn't, and Peckard has fallen at the Beechers over now to the fence after Beechers, and it is Ferrari who's the leader from the Metra, Miss Hunter, and then Steve Brick, Hassel Falls, then Game First, and then Kilburn, Kelsborough Wood, Tam Kiss, then the Fossa, then Highland Wedding, then Fort Sun, then comes the Inventor and Arcturus, and these are the leaders as they come to the canal turn, and all over the the leaders anyway over the canal turn and the leaders are Ferrari and Lemaitre together Steel Bridge is next and then Castle Falls on the outside Miss Hunter is next Rose Barb is next then the Fossa then comes Kelsborough Wood and Kilburn then Highland Wedding Fort Sun then Tam Kiss then Game Post and Arcturus the inventor Filet then Lime Burner then the Beaches and with this order over to Michael Seth Smith and as they come over the 10th it's Mesa Gifford on Ferrari who's the leader he's just in front of Steel Bridge then Lemaitre then the leading Irish challenger at the moment is Miss Hunter, Castle Falls, who's been up with the leaders all the time, coming now in defence number 11, and it's Ferrari and Flo Barb over together, Tam Kiss made a mistake there, Red Alligators about 10 lengths behind the leaders, and Bassnet made a mistake. Now they're coming to fence 12, and it's Mesa Gibbard on Ferrari, being challenged now by Lemitra, then Steel Bridge, then Miss Hunter, then Castle Falls, then the leading of the amateurs in this race, Captain Parker Bowles on the Fossa, about six lengths behind the leaders, Red Alligator going quite steadily at this stage, Highland Wedding just behind the leaders, but as they recross the Melling Road, it's Ferrari, Castle Falls, Lemaitre and Miss Hunter who are the leaders, and with that, back to the grandstand. Castle Falls on the outside, Steel Bridge and Furo towards the inner, Miss Hunter right up with them, just in behind them, Lymetra, then comes Game Purston as well there towards the outside, and a long run now towards the next fence, and it's Lymetra and Castle Falls disputing it, the Fossa towards their outside, just in behind them, Furore. then comes Game Purston, behind Game Purston is Highland Wedding who's right up there. Coming to this fence now, and as they do so, right on the inside, it's Steel Bridge with Fiorori. Then comes Lymetra towards the outside with Castle Falls and the Fossa. Behind them, Miss Hunter. Then the Grey, the Beaches. Castle Falls and the Fossa disputed it over that one. Almost tried for stride with Fior on the inside and then Steel Bridge. Then comes Flo Subarb and Highland Wedding. Behind Highland Wedding is Miss Hunter. Coming to the next fence now, and the one after this will be the chair. And as they come to this, Castle Falls and the Fossa almost tried for stride there from Steel Bridge on the inside, then Fioror. Then Flo Subarb and then Kilburn then Kelsborough Wood on the inside, and then Highland Wedding and Lymetra behind Lymetra is Ville. Then comes the Beaches and Tam Kiss. Behind Tam Kiss is the inventor with Fort Sun and then Rondetto. Then comes Arcturus, and behind Arcturus, and some way behind him is Basnet over the chair now. Steel Bridge on the inside, Flo Subarb, Castle Falls. The inventor nearly went there but got away with it. Coming to the water now for the only time, and Steel Bridge in the lead from Flo Subarb in second, Castle Falls four. Five is Kilburn and six is Furor. Seven is the Fossa on the inside, and then comes Kelsborough Wood, and behind Kelsborough Wood is Highland Wedding and then Lymetra and the Beaches and Fort Sun and behind Fort Sun is Hove. Then comes Miss Hunter and the Great Tam Kiss and then the Inventor behind them Arcturus and then Game Purston. Then comes Rondetto
Moido behind Rondetto, his last year's winner, Red Alligator. Then comes Baznit with Moido's token to the outside, and in behind Moido's token is Lime Burner, and they're the only ones left in the race now. And as they come to anchor crossing for the second time, it's Flo Subarb, Steel Bridge, on the inside, Kilburn. Towards the outside, Castle Falls with the Fosser, and then comes Kelsborough Wood, the Furor just in behind them, and back to Julian Wilson. And this will be at the 17th fence, and it's Castle Falls still disputing it with Flo Subarb towards the inside. Steel Bridge right there, Highland Wedding going really well on the outside, and over that, it was uh, Steel Bridge, who's still just the leader now from Castle Falls weakening, then Flo Subarb, the Fosser still right up there on the outside in Highland Wedding, over that. It was Steel Bridge still disputing it with Fossil towards the outside. Then comes Highland Wedding, close to Arden Kilburn. These five are clear of Castle Falls and the beaches as they come to the next. And it's Steel Bridge who just leads over that one from the Fossa, close to Bob Kilburn, Highland Wedding and Castle Falls. Red Alligators are followed as we join Michael O'Hare. And so also Hove, and now they come to this next fence. And as they do, it is Steel Bridge still the leader. And there's a faller there, Kilburn right up with the leaders too. And the Flo Superb is the faller there. Flo Superb is the faller as they come to this next fence. The fence before beach is the Steel Bridge, the Fossa. Highland Wedding on the outside. Kilburn well there along the inside. Rondetto right up behind the leaders. Fort Sun well there. The beaches is making ground. And Kelsborough Wood is also uh, just behind the leaders. Coming now to Beaches Brook for the second time. And it's Highland Wedding. Steel Bridge on the inside. The Fossa. Kilburn. Rondetto right up with them too. And Highland Wedding is gone. Highland Wedding is gone. And uh, Kilburn is a faller there too and so also is Tam Kiss and now they come now to the fence after features and it's Steel Bridge from Highland Wedding who is in second place there uh, he's recovered and has gone on there and is in second place and third place is the Fosse then comes Ron Detta who's been closely followed by the features making ground steadily and he's being followed uh, by uh, Ford Sun and Kelsborough Wood and now to the canal turn and as they get over the canal turn it's Highland Wedding in fact who jumps it in front Highland Wedding in front of uh, Steel Bridge with then Ron Detta who's been closely followed by the Foster, then the Beaches, Ford Sun and Kelsborough Wood of Basnet making ground in behind these. Over Valentine's now, stretching out over Valentine's, it is Highland Wedding who's in front. Highland Wedding the leader from Steel Bridge and then Ron Detto and then the Foster, the Beaches making ground and then Ford Sun and over to you Michael said Smith. And Eddie Hart here on Highland Wedding, he's in the lead by a length and a half, he had a quick look round over his shoulder there, Jeff King with a black eye on Rondetto coming up very prominently into second place and Josh Giffords beginning his run confidently on Bassnet about five lengths behind the leaders. They're coming now to the 28th fence and Highland Wedding about three lengths clear. He's going terribly well. He's just in the lead though with Steelbridge second, Rondetto third, Josh Gifford in fourth place. He's still making up ground on Bassnet. Then comes Bill Reese on the grey of the beaches and the Fossa losing ground steadily. But as they recross the Melling Road, it's Highland Wedding just in the lead from Steelbridge Rondetto and in fourth place Josh Gifford on Bassnet still making up ground on the leading three and with Highland Wedding the leader back to the grandstand. Highland Wedding by just about half a length from Steelbridge. In behind Steelbridge is Rondetto. Basnet still closing with the leading trio. And the Grey, the Beaches, following them. Behind the Beaches is Kelsbury Wood. And then comes Villay and then Fort Sun. And then comes Arcturus, who's still standing with the Fossa. And they're just about the only ones left in it now. And as they race towards the second last fence, it's Highland Wedding being pressed by Rondetto. Steelbridge. Basnet still making ground in the Grey, the Beaches. Coming to the second last now. And it's Highland Wedding and Eddie Hardy in the lead from Rondetto on the inside, then comes Steel Bridge, and then Basnet who jumps it fourth, then the Grey of the Beaches, they're coming to the final fence now in the 1969 National, and Highland Wedding, 12 years old, going strong in front from Rondetto, Steel Bridge, and Basnet, over the last, it's Highland Wedding, over clear of Rondetto, Steel Bridge, Basnet jumps it fourth, fifth is the Beaches, coming up now towards the elbow, and it's Highland Wedding from Rondetto, the 13-year-old, it's a 12-year-old from a 13-year-old, Steel Bridge, racing after them, Basnet in fourth place, but Highland Wedding with a firm on the run now has only got Steel Bridge to beat Rondetto Wigdon and coming up towards the line Eddie Hardy looking over his shoulder he sees he's got it sewn up and Highland Wedding striding away, he's going to win the 1969 National from Steel Bridge and Rondetto and at the line Highland Wedding is the winner, Steel Bridge is second, Rondetto is third the Beaches is just coming up into fourth place now, fifth is Basnet six Arcturus and seven is Highland Wedding became the third 12-year-old